Right then everybody, welcome back to Anglo Calm. Now, just before I get into this video, I do want to say if you are enjoying the content, make sure you leave a massive like, make sure you subscribe, share the video, and post your comments down below. So today I want to do a quick little review of the Guru um, bait tubs with bait strainer in. Now, this is the one pint one. This is very a very nice tub. I like to put maggots in this and other stuff. When you're not feeding a lot or say you're using maggots as a hook bait, these are very good. But where these for me really excel guys is preparing your micros. And I'm gonna show you guys in this video today how I do it. Now I'm gonna to have to be careful because I've filled this up with water. And also I am gonna put uh, the retail price um, of these on screen somewhere around here. So again, you guys can be the judge of the price and what you think to it. So this is the little strainer. Now with the big, I do have a bigger one at home and that obviously has a bigger strainer. So it's got like little gaps in here and then it has like these little bits. I'll just put this down for now. It has these little bits here for your thumbs so you can lift the strainer out. Now, there's only one problem that I have had with these, to be honest with you, and that is sometimes the micras can get stuck in these gaps here. The gaps are just a little too big for the micras. Now, the mi this is why I'm testing out the one pint one to see whether or not they actually will fall through. But apart from that, I mean, for, for the most part, I think it's a great idea. So... As luck would have it, I've got some micros. So what you do, you fill the bottom bit up with water and then you put your little strainer in. I tend to do this, guys, just so I've got a nice layer of water covering it up. And I'm just going to get some pellets, some micros, and I'm going to put them in. I'll not do many, everybody, just for the purpose of this video. And I'm going to move the camera down so you guys can see. So there they are, they're in the little uh, bait strainer. And then normally I wait about two minutes and then what I do, I literally just lift the strainer out and then it just drains all the water off the pellets and you're left with a really, really nice pellet. So I'm gonna give this a few minutes and um, I'll be back then to show you guys how all this works. Right then everybody, so I've given him a few minutes and it's as simple as lifting this out. And as you can see, the water will drain straight off. No problems, I'm just gonna tip that water away. And then you're left with this and then you can drop it back in and your pellets are draining nice and well. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just tip them into the tub. Um, so actually none have got stuck with this mini one with the big one they did get stuck in the gaps where it seems like with this one they actually don't and you know if you guys can see when i do that this will drain them off nicely and what i do like is the design it's got little feet here so you can stand it up and there's a gap for the water to drain off that's a lovely addition, these little feet here. Yeah, I do like that a lot. And I really do like these bait strains. I think they're a great way of preparing pellets and they just work so well. So if you are looking for a good bait tub, I would highly recommend these Guru ones, guys. They are just a brilliant idea. And if you're one of them where you don't prepare your pellets or your micros the night before, then this is a must have because it's just so easy to get out, put your pellets in, and then just literally let them soak for two minutes, pull that strainer out and they're absolutely perfect and good to go. And they're easy to clean out as well. You just literally run the strainer through the water and it is a very simple setup and easy to use. And also I do want to mention the quality. I've had no breakages on it whatsoever. Again, the little plastic strainer hasn't broke and it's solid as a rock, literally. A great product from Guru, as always. I will be reviewing more Guru products and also more bait tubs. So if you do want to see that, make sure you leave a like on the video. And make sure you comment down below as well. And just before I end this video, I do want to say, make sure you check out Ravenfield Ponds. I'll put a link to their uh, website in the description box below. 
this is an absolute beautiful venue i just quickly want to show you guys round so if you guys can see that just look at this view where i'm at absolutely stunning and a cracking venue so make sure you check ravenfield ponds out in the description below this is a membership based um fishery so yeah and it always supports the um you know supports the venue art as well because they are a charity based venue which is always brilliant so yeah please check them out for me guys uh do them a favor tell them Anglo carl sent you get your send down here there is a little walkway so if you do want to come and have a look at this place you can walk around the path and check it out you won't be disappointed and subscribe to my channel it really does help me out and as always say if you're fishing have a good one